Let's go and happen, everybody. I'm Troy Baker. Hey, and I'm Nolan North. <laughs> hey, who <laughs> is that? I don't know. Uh, once again, we find ourselves with our dear friends Watch Mojo. Yes. Because apparently, the first time, of which there were two, mm -hmm. uh, was not enough. Uh, so people said, hey, we cry foul. And they let slip the dogs of war. And they said we should do another list that is a little bit more approved, I suppose. So what I'm going to do. That um, was a very, very strong intro. Like that? You're getting better. Okay. So here we go. I am going to lead this off uh, by putting you in the hot seat first. Okay, we're what are going we doing? to do another top 10 Nolan North video game performances. And these are the comments. Wow. Another top 10. I'm riveted. That title is longer than your career. So, um, we, by the way, I should say, in all fairness, we're going to watch this in real time. So we are reacting. This is also a reaction. We, we haven't seen this. <laughs> we haven't seen this. I have no idea. I have no idea what's So when happen. it says Troy Baker and Nolan North <clears throat> react to their own top 10 lists. 100% 100%. real. This is, it's, it's like going to the ground leagues. Just, you have nothing's planned. And we're going to yes and. And yes and. Yes and we will yes and. Yes and let's go. Number 10, Hades, God of War. Okay, number 10 is Hades. Hades, yes. A lot of people talk about our Maggie Sansi and Modi. Ren. Maggie oh. and Modi in uh, you know, the, the most recent God of War, but I was right. the original Hades. A lot of people don't know that in God of War. And that's because it's hell yes. dealing with you. And I was probably never, I, I hadn't returned uh, for years. I did Hades and they hadn't had me back till 2018. What did you do? I don't know. <laughs> I love that you should not. He also was not allowed in the parking lot. So would you agree that that's that's your top, that's your tenth, your tenth best role ever? You know they're all so good. Number nine, Sigmund, Ratchet and Clank Future, A Crack in Time. Okay, number nine, Sigmund, Ratchet and Clank. Yes. This is one that you. This is kind of one of your personal favorites. Would you put it yes. at number nine? Uh. <laughs> Sure, no. I mean, it's a top ten, but you it was... You count. It's like ten, nine is from the bottom. What I'm saying is it was it was an interesting one because, you know, it was very cartoony. Oh, sir, you know, Sigmund. And it was not processed. It was, oh, yo, yes, of course, Sigmund, 0426A, while well, you were unconscious. I mean, it was... I really enjoyed this one a lot because it was one of the first games where I got to do something like cartoony and almost kid-like. Was, was, was that... Right. What year was that? 2000... And I remember uh, our good friend TJ Fixman. Yes. Uh, it cast me in that, and, uh, and I'm very, very grateful. Our whiskey bro. Our whiskey bro. And what's going to be number eight? That's the question, and that's going to ah. do like a really cool Number eight, Jason Fleming, Shadow Complex. Jason, Shadow Complex. Speaking yes. of TJ Fixman, he also loves this one. Yes. Okay, but the funny thing about this, this is, look at. Kind of looks like familiar. Kind of looks like, kind of like great. A little familiar. Uh, what is Shadow Complex? Shadow Complex was a side scroller uh, in gameplay. It was actually very, very cool. And it won the Game Award. Uh, first time I was ever in a Game Award, and I, was, and I got to meet Mark Hamill at the Game Awards uh, years and years ago. Wait, wait, wait. wait Shadow wait. Complex was a small indie uh, developer, and they, uh, it won. It won the. Uh, Did you do mocap for this? No, no, it wasn't mocap. So that's somebody else's body with your. With your I don't know if it's mocap because it was it was more of a like the, I, from what I remember I think the gameplay was side scroll. This was back in the day when nobody cared about uh, you know like <laughs> nobody cared about, about what this. we do. They're like I just like get, listen to my tunes and play games. Number seven, Ghost, the Destiny series. So okay, would you agree that this is a seven on the list? You know what? They're all kind of number ones, but they all can't. Everybody get number one. So they're so all marginal. It's so like everybody gets a, it's like it's, it's, everybody gets a trophy for just for showing up for soccer. It doesn't I, matter that actually. By the Billy way, I actually... can't stand that. So <laughs> I don't get me started. No, uh, this this is uh, this is one of my favorite roles. That is a current role to this day. It's one of my favorites because um, Bungie's a really cool developer to work for. Uh, they're just a very good company to, to work for. Ding. <laughs> no, wait a minute. Destiny Two. Oh, no, no, this is, they're just. Yeah. They're just showing. I was going to say, you stuff. can't do that. More importantly, I am your ghost. Mm. Eyes up, Guardian. Destiny. Yeah, this was one of the uh, ones where I, or got, I replaced Peter Dinklage uh, 
from the original. I've never, never heard this story. Number six, Remy Duvall, Mafia 3. Remy Duvall, look at, they, that kind of looks like it me. It looks exactly like you, it's a little scary. Number six, this is a, <laughs> this is a unique. <laughs> yeah. You are starting to sweat. It's yeah. a little uncomfortable for this you. This is a tough one. Uh, so, see, I did, I did a bunch of the Mafia ones. Oh yeah, we know about uh, that. But Mafia 3, Remy Duvall was, um, it was a horrifying racist. Mm -hmm. He's doing sock puppets. As a matter of fact, somebody somebody mentioned that about me. They started hey, like, in Mafia 3, Nolan North was tied to a cross, further confirming the idea that he is Jesus. Uh, no, I was set on fire. Upside down. I was set on fire on that cross. <laughs> and Jesus also didn't use the N-word. But anyway. Um, Neither did Nolan uh, North. <laughs> Remy Duvall <laughs> used that word. And uh, it was very, very, look, there I am. Look, there I am wearing a, a hood. Oh. Do you know I've never seen, and there I am on fire. On, uh, Wait, you never saw it? No. No, I, I like I, Johnny Depp. You just don't like watching your own stuff. I do not. Number five, The Boss, Saints Row 4. Now, this brings me up. I love you. Wait, I'm sorry. This brings me up. This brings me up. This just brings me up. Your number five yes, is Saints Row as the boss, which I'm sorry, you were, you were a marketing ploy. It's pretty cool, isn't it? Yes, and I wish it was me. But you're the boss as well. Yeah, but yeah, you know what? It was it's, you. So it, but, the, but the thing about it that you have to understand in Saints Row, and I think any Saints Row fans know, you can choose to be voice of player, you know, male you're player one. one, and you get his voice. Yeah. Male player two, yeah. then yeah. there's female Maybe player one, two, like, and then there's just Nolan just North. Just Nolan North. And you walk around and you have the smartest quips. I. But it's the same lines. No, you got your own No, unique. I didn't. Yes, you absolutely did. You're absolutely wrong. I had to say everything Laura Bailey said. I had to follow exact her script and her time. But you also got your very own, like your shout outs and stuff were all your own. They were so unique. Oh, that's true. Number four, August, Tales from the Borderlands. Oh, now the, now the telltale. Oh, another one. Yeah. Yeah, dude, you, uh... Weren't you something in this? That's the... That's the lead. The, were you? That was the guy. What was your character? I was August. Yeah, you were August. You're a month. I have a name. I was August. Reese. Reese. There he is. Look at that handsome devil. They... I kind of look like you. They, this is the first time that they added socks. To, like, they, like, changed the character design for me because... And they had me look like Gideon Emery. Yeah. Okay. It's pretty cool. You can cut things with your. You know what I like about like? Let's give a shout out to Telltale. It's great hard. writing. Uh, it is great writing. Brilliant Pat, writing. And our favorite, who's our favorite boy in that? Patrick Ooh. Warburg. Patty Bucks. Patty. Patty Warburg. I know. Best guess. Got his face ripped off. Yeah. Number three, Modi, God of War, 2018. Look at crack. this, dude. Magni oh, and Modi, dude. Magni and Modi. He got Modi's. Oh, Trey is gonna come in. Whip look you, boy. Like, no, no, I can't. Boy. Look at that. That looks like me on a weekend. My kid gets out of hand. I kind of look at that. Know. I was riding in this beast. Hey, let's throw that over there. This is the only thing. This was fun watching this because we got to see. Here we are. Look at that. I just wish now we they, we they brought us and we didn't get to do the mocap. For I this. know. Wouldn't that have been great? Would have been, we'd never would have got anything done with Chris and and you and I. Yeah. That would have been. <laughs> and at the end though, do they show the end? Yeah, there he is. Yeah, and he kicks, and bye -bye. stabs me in the throat, and the kid kicks me off a cliff. Story of my life. Yep. Every day I oh, wake, I wake up, tale. take my kid, and say, "Hey, you gotta go to school," and he kicks, kicks you me off the cliff. Just off a cliff. Off a cliff. Not a cliff. He kicks me in the groin. Number two, Rocket Raccoon, Guardians of the Galaxy, the Telltale series. Number two, Rocket Raccoon. Yeah. Would you say number two? <laughs> well, uh, we've already went upon through ten what? before. What? I don't know. I'll tell you one thing. I again, it's Telltale. That is some of the the, the best writing. And just to do an iconic character like that, angry little uh, little yeah. raccoon. By the way, I got a raccoon at my house. Getting into the garbage. Not cool. Nature's thieves. They are uh, stealthy. Yeah, they're. They are stealthy. They can actually uh, not, uh, get some stuff done. I'm not a fan of raccoons. Um, would you put that number two? Uh, you know what? Uh, I actually do think it was, was it was one of the uh, 
a better performance that I had for the character that's already been established. Our buddy Trevor Duvall does the, yes. does a great rocket in the, 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 the series for Guardians yeah. of the Galaxy. So it was nice to kind of put my own little stamp on it. Um, I just don't know oh, where you go from here. Like, what's <coughs> gonna be your number one? Oh, there's so many. There's really not anymore. They're kind of... Kind of running out. Mm, dredging. Before we unveil our number one pick, here are some honorable mentions. Okay, so okay, Scraping. so this is gonna be the thing. Who? Oh, hold on, honorable mentions. Do honorable Sergeant mentions. Forge. Sergeant Forge, look at how cool I look. John like. Forge. Sergeant, Halo Sergeant Forge. John Forge. Oh, the, the paradox. paradox. Cyril le, le Paradox. No, Scooper. From that was Spy? great because, uh, no. Atomic Joker. Come on. Yeah. Atomic Joker. Number one, Edward Richtofen, the Call of Duty series. Number one, Richtofen. Okay, yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. You're going to put Richtofen number one? Of course. He's been around since 2008. I, yeah, good Ten for you. years of Dr. Richtofen. Yeah, why not? That's. But because, I'm sorry, no matter what list, first of all, these are all subjective. But no matter what list you do, it's gonna, it's gonna be Drake. Like you got, you just gotta. No, these are like not, another. This yeah, is sure. another top ten. These and are, on another top ten, it's still gonna be this that. This is tier two of the top ten. See, tier one ends with Drake. Then there's tier two. Um, by the way, do you know how many tiers there are in my career? Forty-eight. That almost broke. 48 tiers of top 10s, 480. Hey, look, we got a song in this. So let me get this straight. So in my top 10, I had I had a racist Klansman and a German from World War II. Same. An angry rodent. Same. I guess the only way, and and Hades, the, which is where basically all of them the, will burn. The administrator of hell. <laughs> um, so basically, I play some dark, dark people. Yes. Thank uh, you, Watch Mojo. Yeah. Now, Thank you for pulling out all of my horrible. Oh, you're not getting off this easy. What, what we haven't even gone to the no. comments yet. Oh no, we should just end it. No. First of all, Stephen Whitlow says, "Can't wait to see Nolan and Troy talking about this list on Retro Replay." You're watching it right now, Stephen Whitlow. <laughs> <gasps> Um, why not a top 10 on his cartoon voice performances? Question mark, 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 question mark. Um, you know what? We should, that's that's something for the future. don't set it up like that. You know, we can't do that because I would have top 10s and he wouldn't. It's true. Why no Merasmus? Merasmus, because it's a cheap ripoff of Vincent Price. Merasmus, that could be in the next tier of top 10s. <laughs> tier, tier four. Tier three, <laughs> tier two. Um, Dirty Sock says, I just remember him as Spencer Dad in Pretty Little Liars, laughing so much I'm crying face. Maybe that's why your socks are dirty. Hmm? Watching a little Pretty Little Liars? Ooh, uh, no. Cheap. <gasps> Bad Nolan. Why would, you, why would you say that? At least you fixed your glaring mistake by adding Richtofen. Okay. Well, they're talking about Watch Mojo, not Savage. us, right? Yeah, I hope so. Okay. Because I'm still not in my list. All right. Uh, again, you were a add-on pack. We do not re have to read all the comments. Oh, no, but just some fun ones. Okay. Another one from Erasmus. If you have the option to choose Nolan North's voice for your in-game character, is there really other option? Yeah, mine. Oh, okay, <laughs> Dale Grouper. I liked Troy's voice for the boss better. Well, Dale. I like your voice better. Dale has been Dale eating Grouper. paint. No. <laughs> Uh, um, Moises Ferrer, I said your name wrong, forgive me. Just waiting for the retro replay reaction on this video. Here it is. Okay. Alvin Adams, number one, I didn't like that character one bit, he is a big jerk. That must be for your list. Oh, it is. Yeah. Mm. All right, I don't want to talk about you anymore. Really? It, well. Hey, thanks for joining us here on Retro Replay, mm -hmm. uh, doing our Watch Mojo Top 10 amazing performances just, of it, Tier 2. It, it just says another. Of mine. Doesn't say amazing. Another? Just another. Well, just more. That is a synonym. <laughs> That's no, mm, the cinnamon button. Oh, cinnamon 
<laughs> so, <laughs> hey, tune into Retro Replay and watch us and our silliness and keep watching Watch Mojo for more of our top 10 amazing performance lists. Another. It doesn't say amazing. It says amazing. <laughs> on book. your page it does. Because yeah, I wrote it. I wrote it down. <laughs> I read it. I believe everything I read. Uh, but also stay tuned because <laughs> guess who's next? Do, 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 do. I don't feel good. You shouldn't. Hey guys, a big thank you to Troy Baker and Nolan North and the entire Retro Replay team for putting this together. If you like Retro Replay, you can check out their channel here. Or if you want to see our previous collaboration with them, you can go right here. Or here. Or maybe here. <laughs>